Hello YouTube, this is Hoffman here and um, today I'm going to show you how to make uh, multiplication in Minecraft. This is a multiplication tutorial. Uh, the reason I'm making this is because I got a message from 11 Atletbet to do it because he saw my 4 block tall multi uh, a binary multiplier. Uh, I would start by saying this is a 10 bit and I know it's uh, six block tolls, not four block tolls. It's six block tolls, and um, it's just three bit, so it's easier to understand. Uh, when m doing multiplication in Minecraft, you are turning addition into multiplic no multiplication into addition. So you actually, when you multiply two numbers, you are actually uh, making them, adding them together in a series of ways. So if we remember m uh, binary numbers, this is 1, this is 2, this is 4, and this is 8. Just so you need to know this, that this is on, it's 1, it's both these on, it's 3, and with this is on, it's 2. So that's the m binary numbers, just to refresh them up. Uh, in normal numbers, when we are multiplying multiplying two numbers, let's say 5 and 4. We say 5 times 4. That actually means taking 5 4 times. And if we think about that, it's the same as 5 plus 5 plus 5 plus 5. It may seem a little simple, but uh, that's the thing we have to keep in mind, that we can turn multiplication into addition by taking one number the amount of times that it re it's required. So if we t keep that in mind that we can turn it over to uh, multiplication over to an addition we are saying this one. If we have a number let's say 3 we want to add to 6. Let's do the calculation it's equal to yes you heard it right 18. I just had to think about it. <laughs> Embarrassing. I'm going to the high school and studying math, so yeah, but if we can say what this this is number six, what numbers does this consist of? It consists of a four and a two. And we knew we could make multiplication over two additions. So saying three times six is actually the same as saying three times two plus 3 times 6. My voice just got a little high there. But if you remember that, we are very far, uh, very close to the goal. Because 4 times 3 is the same, plus 2 times 3 is the same as 6 times 3. So, and if we look at this, if every time we go one step to the left, the number is doubled. So, let's. this is 3 and if we just turn those to one to the left, it becomes six. And one to the left, it becomes twelve. Magnificent, right? So, keeping the original three in mind, we are first adding it by two. That will mean that we are moving it one to the left. Then. Uh, we are multiplication by 2 and then the original 3 is in another string I'm just gonna make the string the original 3 is then being multipli multiplied by 4 that would mean moving 2 to the left, and then those two strings are added together. And we have 6 here, and we have 12 here, so that means we will end up with 18. And that's how multiplication works just simply by m being a little bit clever and uh, using uh, the very fine thing about binary that whenever you multiply by two or any factors of two it just move one to the right or the amount of factors to the right yeah 
the last one wasn't a little bit hard to understand. But, so, how do we create this? I'm just going to show you now. If we take the same number here, and multiply by 3, we can see this is the string here. We, the highest thing we can add and multiply it to, to it change the position, is 4. So, we can say 1 here, this is the 1, this is the first thing. 2 here, this is number 2, this is 1, this is 2. And 4 here, this is number 4. So, let's get both have 1, 2 and 4. Number 2 we see right here, has both at the beginning 2, then it has 4, and then it has 8. And number 4 has up to 16, because it's just 1 to the right. So, this is right here at the bottom, we have three strings of three full letters. So we have nine full letters together here. And if we just say um, three multiplied by three, we know this, when this is off, the number is on. So this is off, so it allows the signal here be careful, this is 1, this is 2, and this is 4. And we see number 2 and number 4 is on. So that actually means that 1 and 2 is getting into calculation, the full letters. Then we move a step up, so this is 2 and this is 4. And this is 8. These, this last one here isn't on, so we do not have to watch this and we see this is off just like the other so down here we see that this is off and this is off so this is actually 4 because it's multiplied by 2 it allows this signal to trail through here so this is 4 and this is 2 right here so the number 1, number 2, number 2 and number 4 so this one just goes right up to the result here. This one are added together and in the to the carry input here. Just carry output from this full letter to the carry input in this full letter. And then you have one here and one here. That actually turns it to this carry output in the full letter. And we are going out here, which sends the signal out here. So we get an eight. So three times three is 8, 1 and 8 is on, as you can see. So that to prove the right. The biggest amount, the biggest number you can have an, as an output is right here. The 7 times 7, everything is on. We can't make a bigger, larger output. And we get this result. 32 plus 16 plus 1, that's 49. And 7 times 7 is 49, so it's correct. Yeah, <laughs> and that's really all there is to binary multiplication. By turning it into addition, we can make it fairly easy. Yeah, that's really it. <laughs> Thank you for watching, and if you have any questions, uh, please subscribe or uh, comment or send me a message. And I hope this was. Uh, Placeful for you uh, living at a bit that you found it helpful because yeah otherwise I could make another movie if you want me to explain it uh, more deep going or anything like that but yeah thank you for watching and um, have a good day.